so when you guys hear some sounds in this video those are the sounds coming from the geese there is geese there is ducks here there is pigeons and different kind of birds i don't i don't know the name of those black ones somebody said yesterday in the video that <laughs> they were hearing sounds of uh, of the demons from hell those are not demons they are geese okay <laughs> all right guys listen to me um i got a very big revelation uh a few weeks a few weeks after when i after i left the the greater narcissist i got a very i got a very big revelation about the star before i talk about the star i would like to talk about the difference between the regular narcissist and the greater narcissist all the spiritual narcissist okay so the greater narcissist is a low ranking demon okay the regular narcissist is a low ranking demon but the greater narcissist is a high ranking demon okay so there is levels to these uh these types of individuals but the difference is that um the ordinary narcissist the lesser one they do they usually do things unconscious okay so they're not conscious about the things that they do so most of the time this abuse that you see happening to you they are not conscious because a lot of things they do they don't know what they are doing them even some of the things they say they will forget most of the things that they are saying so those low ranking demons the lesser narcissist they are usually not aware of the star they may be aware that okay so this person this person is a very good person they are nice and they are beautiful inside and out and everything they have got all this compassion and everything so they may know a lot of these things on a very spiritual uh, sorry on a very physical level you know the 3d level but the greater narcissist actually is aware of what they are doing so when they pop up in your life they are actually aware of what they are doing so they are very conscious of the things they are doing those are the high ranking demons and they are aware of your star so they know this star okay how do i know this they know that you've got a star so the star is like um this is like the crown your crown your uh, power your energy your blessings your gifts your beauty your essence your empathy The energy of a chosen one is an energy that is compared to no other. Okay? So those are the guys I've told you, you do not see those guys everywhere that you go. It is going to be very difficult. You may meet them very quietly. They are very quiet people. They may usually speak less. You may even sometimes come across them without even knowing it. They may just pass you without even knowing. They are very quiet people. So those people, they come with the hair, a lot of... Um, they come with the whole package. Okay? The greater narcissist, when I met the greater narcissist, um, I remember the greater narcissist told me something. They told me that, you know, those were the early weeks, uh, probably two or three weeks, I think, into that entanglement. So the greater narcissist told me that, you know that you're a very beautiful person, but you don't even know that, you know? So that time I had awakened, but I was not yet really... Um, I hadn't yet gotten so much knowledge and whatever, you know, I hadn't really gotten, I was starting, I was just starting my awakening journey. So that's when I met this great analysis. The great analysis told me that, do you know that you're a very beautiful person? And you don't even know that. That is something used to buffer me. It spent about, it, this, thing, this thing took around, it took about three, four times I was hearing that statement. And I was thinking that, why does this person think that? Why do they think that I don't know who I am? You know what I mean? You see, the thing is, those people are dangerous. It's the reason I've told you guys in my videos that you've got to be very careful. 
these narcissists have got uh, they have got grades okay so they are the low grade ones and there is the there's the high grade ones so those high grade ones are very very dangerous okay so when you're trading with those kind of individuals if you don't know them ladies and gentlemen look for the signs but those ones are very dangerous because those people when they are they are going to destroy you with both hands okay and they're also going to destroy you energetically so they are going to do things consciously they will know what they are doing okay very much aware of what they are doing the lesser ones may not really know what they are doing they may just find it themselves somewhere somehow gravitating towards you and whatever it is but they may not really know the real depth of what they're really doing okay but the greater ones those high ranking ones they know okay they are a bit more enlightened than these other ones the the lesser ones It does not matter which kind of narcissist you have met. That narcissist is... They are after your star, okay? If you know yourself that you are a chosen one, you are this beautiful person on the inside and outside, you have got to know that these people, they are after your star. They are looking for the light, okay? So everybody wants a piece of the cake. Somebody will come to you for very particular reasons when you go out somewhere another person will come to you for another reason another one will come to you for another so they everybody wants to come and grab a piece of the cake now you see for a chosen one you will know how to get back your energy especially the ones who have awakened of course you have gone, you have gone through this awakening and you know a lot about yourself you know how to get this energy back okay so whatever they take from you normally it will get back to you so the reason why i've usually told you guys to let the narcissist go on this channel ladies and gentlemen unless you don't want to be free if you're still following me until this moment and you're still doubting yourself and you're still there hanging around with the narcissist and you're still thinking about when when you're leaving or i'm thinking about what to do and this if you're still thinking twice okay take your time i know i understand you've got to make a few moves to make your moves i understand i get it but i'm breaking up at free on this channel ladies and gentlemen the reason why i'm on this path i'm telling you things that are going to save your life so if you're a person who is following me you at best believe on this channel you're going to get awakened and i'm saving your life okay It doesn't matter which kind of narcissist you meet. They are after your star. They are looking for the light. They want a piece of the cake. But you see, some of the times, the reason why you hear people talking about energy vampires, when you're around those people, because they have got a very dark energy around them. So whenever they're around you, they are tapping into your energy, okay? Like I've said, the lesser ones may not know what they are doing. They may do it unconsciously. But the high-ranking demons, the, the greater ones, the spiritual ones, the ultra ones, those ones, they are very much aware of what they are doing. So they simply know that just by being around you, they are going to tap into your energy. So the more they stay around you, is the more energy they take from you. Does that make sense? A narcissist needs your energy to survive okay so the more energy they get from you is the more they continue to shine because i've told you guys these are dark spirits okay so they are a rolling ball of negative energy a roll ball a rolling ball of dark energy when that ball comes around and gravitates towards you and it stops around you that energy taps into your energy okay and they start to tap into your greatness so normally when i talk about stealing your star what i mean is that they are stealing some of your gifts so normally you're going to see that the blessings that are meant to be for you those blessings are being directed towards somebody else they are being directed towards those individuals so the things that are meant for you so the reason why you hear many of us we are talking about this thing of protecting your energy the simple thing we are telling you we are telling you is that you have got to get away 
from low vibrational people, toxic people. Okay, those kind of energy vampires. Get away from them. You have nothing to do with them. You don't. You don't owe them. Any, you don't owe them anything. You get away from them. Stay away from them. I do not look back. So when they're around you, they are um, tapping into your energy and they're stealing your gifts. They're stealing your blessings. Well, on the physical level, it may look like you're giving them money. But remember that when you're exchanging money with these individuals and you're giving them your money, you're giving away your power as well. So the money also goes with your power. You understand? If you give them the sex, you sleep with them, you're giving them away. You're giving away your energy. So that energy also goes with away, goes away with your power. Okay? So you are simply transferring your energy over to these individuals. And most of the times, for the work, for the, for the unawakened people, you already know that they are not aware of what they are doing. Okay? So sometimes you may think that this person means well for you. But the only thing they are actually after is what is inside of you. So they are not really worried about what is outside of you? Yes, they may like the car you drive, or they may like the body, your body, or whatever, the, all, all these physical attributes, whatever the things you have physically. But usually, the spiritual, the spiritual matter of this whole thing is that they are actually trying to tap into what you have inside of you. Okay. So most of these narcissists, they know that when they are around you, that they are going to be benefiting from a lot of things. Okay. So they know that whenever they come around you. Their lives are going to take off. Very many beautiful things start happening to them. And on the other hand, you do not know why you feel drained. You feel low. You know, you feel depressed. You have stressed all the time. You can't work. You can't think properly. You're falling sick. You're all the time ill. You can no longer think for yourself. You don't even know what is happening to you. Okay? These low vibrational spirits, ladies and gentlemen, they are after your star. And you have got to remember that they have done this for a very long period of time. So this whole thing has started way, way back ever since you was a child. So this whole thing started in your family. You understand me? The process of tapping into and stealing your star and your shine started in your family. Then it kept on spreading outside in your friendships, it continued in your relationships, it continued in your church, it continued in your school. The reason why you hear a lot of people, especially very high sensitive people, um, normally at the end of abuse, there is some people who normally kill themselves. Okay, so you guys have heard about the suicide. Because normally when a person has been draining all your energy, it's like sometimes you have nothing left, okay, and you do not, you do not have the power to take one further step uh, one further step up or uh, one further step forward is the reason as to why you hear some people most of the times you hear cases where people they say that they have killed themselves somebody took his life or she took a life or he took his life it is because those people they feel that they have nothing left for them okay everything is gone the only way you are going to be able to get back your sanity to get back your blessings to get back your energy to get back your shine, to get back your money, to get back your property, to get back your health, your wealth, to get back your gifts, to get back your soul, you have got to leave the narcissist. Let me repeat this one more time. The moment you master the art of leaving a narcissist, I can guarantee you, ladies and gentlemen, you are going to get back everything that the enemy has ever stolen from you. Is that a coincidence that when you have left the Nazis and gotten them out of your life, do you think that it's a coincidence why you all of a sudden started glowing? You're shining. You're more healthy. You're more pretty. You're more handsome. You've got a lot of energy. Everything that they have ever taken from you is coming back to you because you have gotten them out of your life. So now, they no longer have the limits, they no longer have the means and the access to you, to your energy. They have already moved off somewhere else, maybe tapping into somebody else's energy. 
but now you're getting everything that they've ever taken from you so normally when i talk about the healing process i'm telling you to leave them and then go out there and put in the work and start healing okay because also healing brings you closer to your soul you understand the more you heal and the more you heal and the more you heal is the more the higher you vibrate so you vibrate higher by healing so the higher you vibrate you're calling back your power okay when you continue embarking on this healing journey and you put a lot of emphasis and energy on the healing you're continuously going to be calling back your power to you your energy back to you your blessings back to you your gifts are coming back to you your soul your memory your health your wealth everything that the enemy has been taking from you is gravitating back towards you but initially you've got to know that the reason why you have been struggling and you've been suffering is because somebody has already stolen your stuff okay those are the people they call them the narcissists the energy vampires the psychopaths the sociopaths they have nothing for you they have not they have not even one good intention for you and the earlier you wake up the better for you so let me not think about this video in the comment section below you guys know that i do love and appreciate your support you can book a session you may donate or support my channel if you want to everything you need you will find it in the description below and until then i'll catch you guys in my next one there's almost signing out much love and blessings peace